Social networks have defining characteristics, and recent works on social networks within the area of mathematics and physics have focused on three distinctive features relating to social network structure. The first feature is called the small world effect. Dating back to 1967, Stanley Milgram, an American social psychologist, described an experiment about posting letters from one person to another person through known acquaintances. From this experiment, he discovered that many peers of apparently distanced people are actually reachable through a very short chain of intermediate acquaintances. He provided a more specific length of this chain, which is six, and later on, this formed the foundation of the theory six degrees of separation. A few studies have shown that many virtual networks share this small world property. The second property of social networks that has been emphasized in recent work is clustering. It is obvious in the example of Facebook, where the probability that two of your friends know one another is much greater than the probability that two people chosen randomly from Facebook know each other. We will cover clustering in more detail in the next section. The last feature is the property of having a skewed degree distribution. In graph theory, the degree of a node is the number of edges that connects to it, and the degree distribution is the probability distribution of these degrees in the graph. In the example of collaboration networks, the nodes represent the authors, and the edges represent the co-authorships of at least one scientific articles between both authors. The degree of the edges denotes the number of publications from both authors. In the graph, the degree distribution have a highly skewed form, approximately obey a power law for a large range. We will talk more about power laws later in this section. Next, we will look at the different models of web and social networks.